Welcome back. We are here looking at the cryptocurrency market, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Wednesday, April 28, 2021. If you like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button to see our new videos, and you're welcome to follow our trades over at Etro. The link is down below. So we'll start by looking at Bitcoin. As you can see, Bitcoin fell towards the 46 uh, K and has rallied significantly since then. We're trading at 55K and we are testing the 20 exponential moving average at this point. So it looks like we are running out of momentum, but it has also been on a massive rally. This has been on. So it did fall uh, over 20% and then we have basically gained, uh, well, roughly half of that uh, since uh, this rally started. If we break above the 20, then we are going to test the 50 in the middle of the bullish band. And if that basically breaks and we have a closing above the 50, then we'll most likely go and retarget these previous highs again. If we find a major resistance here and we roll over, then we could test these previous lows again at 46k. If you look at the, the technical indicators, they are all turning around except for the RSI. RSI is flat at this current stage, but other technical indicators are turning around. MACD is most likely going to cross the signal line indicating bullish momentum. Stochastic has crossed the signal line and is bullish at this point. And the CCI is um, heading towards zero and into positive territory, which also is a sign of bullishness. So it's going to be um, make or break around here at the 20 exponential. If we rally, uh, this rally continues and breaks the 20 and the 50, then we could go higher. If we find a major resistance here and won't be able to break this, then we could head back towards the previous lows. So let's look at Ethereum. So Ethereum got to, uh, to uh, basically all time highs today at uh, 2622. Are uh, we trading at right at this current stage? We're getting fairly overstretched and uh, we're also on the edge of being overbought. Technical indicators are looking very bullish for Ethereum, and it has basically been outperforming Bitcoin um, as a cryptocurrency. So it fell towards the 20 exponential, and 20 exponential has been major support in the past, and it was also um, this time it basically fell from the uh, very highs here. So at this current stage, we could target, um, or basically the target here will most likely be 3,000, but we'll probably have a pullback towards the 20 exponential before getting towards uh, 3,000. So let's look at Cardano. So Cardano has also rallied significantly. We are basically, we crushed the 50 moving average, the 20 exponential moving average, and also the middle of the bullish band. And at this current stage, it looks like we're heading back towards these previous highs. We're trading at uh, 1.29 at this current stage, and the very highs here are at uh, 1.47, or basically that is the top of the bullish band and these previous highs, which we tested three times. If you look at the, the technical indicators, we can see the MACD has turned around and will most likely cross the signal line tomorrow, indicating bullish momentum. Stochastic is bullish, CCI is heading in towards 100 and is becoming bullish, and the RSI is technically flat at this current stage. So if we turn around here, we'll most likely find support at the 20 and the 50 moving average before going higher. So let's look at Litecoin. So Litecoin, very similar to Cardano, has rallied significantly from major support down here at the 50 moving average. So we fell like a rock and now we have rallied. So last two trading days have been fantastic, but today nothing or basically the last two trading days have been fantastic. And now we're trading just above the middle of the bullish band. If you look at technical indicators, they are all turning around and becoming bullish, except for the RSI, which is a flat at this current stage. So if we pull back from here, 20 exponential will offer support and, pro and also the 50, as we can see back here, that the 50 has been a major support for this cryptocurrency. If you continue rallying from here, they'll most likely find resistance up here at the $304. So let's look at NEO. So NEO has also uh, found support at the 20 exponential. It did not fall as far as most of the other cryptocurrencies have fallen. And most of these cryptocurrencies are actually outperforming uh, Bitcoin at this point. So Bitcoin fell uh, significantly further than most of these uh, cryptocurrencies have. And so NEO fell from 131 all the way down towards, uh, give or take, uh, 72. And now we're trading at 94. So it has 
basically been a massive rally the last two trading days. Technical indicators are fairly bullish, except for the MACD is basically underneath the signal line and is flat. Stochastic is bullish, CCI is bullish, and the RSI is also fairly flat at this point. So at this point, it looks like we are about to turn around and head back towards the previous highs. Pullbacks will find major support at the 20 exponential moving average. So let's look at Dash. So Dash has also rallied the last two trading days and is trading uh, just underneath the middle of the bullish band. Technical indicators are turning around. MACD is also turning around in uh, bullish territory. If we break above the middle of the bullish band, we'll probably head towards the very top here at 357. Uh, break down from here, we'll most likely find support at the 20 exponential and even the 50 moving average down here at 250. So let's look at Tron. So Tron has uh, also rallied the last two trading days. So it has been the pattern with all of the cryptocurrencies. If you look at them, they fell together and they're basically rising together. And uh, some have, of course, been more volatile and have risen significantly more. But most of them have the last two trading days rallied significantly from support towards the, at least the middle of the bullish band. Uh, Tron is uh, trading just in between the 20 exponential and the middle of the bullish band at 0 0.1234. Uh, so technical indicators are turning around. Not all of them have become bullish. RSI is flat. CCI is still in negative territory. Stochastic is bullish. And the MACD is still flat at this point underneath, zero, uh, underneath the signal line. If we break below the 20 exponential, we could open the door to the 50 yet again at 0 0.09. And rally above the fifth, uh, the middle of the bullish band could open the door to the top of the bullish band here at 0 0.16. So, hope you find this helpful. You're welcome to support the channel by subscribing, hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos, and you're welcome to join us over here at Ethereum. The link is down below. Good luck and thank you very much.